Hello there, thanks for joining me today at Fishing For Real. My name's Ken. Today I'm out on the Blackwater River again on this nice new dock. This is uh, upstream from the you know, like uh, Escambia Bay, Blackwater Bay. It's near Pensacola. Anyway, I've got some, uh, I got some Spanish sardines, some cigar minnows, and some finger mullet, and some of my salted shrimp. I'm gonna toss those out here on the bottom. On a fish finder rigs and see what I can catch. Last time I was out here, a fella caught a real nice uh, red drum out in the channel here. I want to thank you for joining me. Let's get going and see what I can catch. Let's try some of my freshly minted salted shrimp. This is a little number two inline circle hook. Not an offset circle hook. The offset hooks tend to uh, can actually gut hook a fish. Put that out there. See what happens. Anyone that hasn't seen any of my older videos, I came up with the idea of putting my hooks and swivels at least on safety pins. See, that keeps your, your hooks and your swivels organized. You can get them off one at a time. They don't get snagged on one another. It's a handy dandy way of keeping uh, your hooks and swivels under control. So when you want one, you can get one. You don't gotta fight for it. Got my little gold hook, put me a little piece of salted shrimp on here. I did not bring any magic thread. But that's okay. Drop it right here off the edge of the dock. Put it to the bottom and pick it up about that far. Now it's about a foot off the bottom. I want to give a shout out to Josh who caught this nice slot redfish. You had to pinch the tail or what? 25, 20... 25 and less, a little under 25 and a half. 18 to 27. So he ain't 27 and he ain't 18. So he's good old slot. Thank you. Sure thing, man. I'm gonna take this uh, big dude, big heavy duty uh, rig here until I can get some cut bait or live bait a little bit of gonna put a hunk of shrimp on here and maybe that'll attract something you just never know I got a five volt circle hook a little float to keep it up off the bottom away from the catfish and turtles two ounce no roll got a bead above my swivel bead above my float and a Sinker stop this keeps the sting sinker from going way up the line when you cast. Sometimes when you cast these things, that sinker will go way up the line. And it will really mess up your, your cast. You can't get it as far as you could if the sinker would stay stationary. So I'm gonna put me a piece of my salted shrimp on here. A piece of salted shrimp on here while I'm waiting for a the bait fish to take my little bit of shrimp and I'll toss this sucker way out there. Oh boy. Put that right there. Put me a jingle bell on here if I can. Alert, alarm. There we go. Ooh look at this. Oh, oh. oh look at here, croaker. Oh no. Yeah, that's a croaker. Hot dog, hot dog. Yeah, buddy. That's a croaker. Guys, listen to him croaking. Yeah. Okay, Phil. I got you. There we go. 
this over here out of the way. Put you in there for just a minute, fella. Hey, that's what I wanted is a live croaker. And so he just came, happened to come through. First fish on my little Daiwa. XD40. Live croaker. On some salted shrimp. Oh, there's a fish. I got a fish. Good deal. What have I got? What on earth have I caught here? I have got myself a pinfish. There's something, buddy. There's something. I've got something on here, buddy. Ain't fighting much. What have I got? Dude, I hope it ain't a turtle. I see it ain't got no fight to it. It's just heavy weight. What on earth can this be? A log? Gonna catch me a log. Ay, ay, ay. It's up at the top. Oh, boy. Is it a dead gum soft shell turtle? Man. I think it's a soft shell turtle. He don't want to come this way, whatever he is. Yep. Soft shell turtle. Good gravy. Look at him. Unbelievable. Oh boy. Huh, seriously. Not what I wanted to catch. Oh, dude. Oh my goodness. Holy cow, I got him by the, the neck. I don't get near that. Holy cow. He, <clears throat> you don't like me at all. There you go. Whew. Unbelievable. There he is. All right, I got something here. A bluegill? <laughs> the heck, Comet? Seriously? Oh, man. Okay. A bluegill. A brackish water bluegill. All right, I got something here doing. Yeah, got something. I don't. It ain't hitting on much, I feel like. Bite wise. Maybe something I can use for bait. Anything but a gar or a turtle. What did I got here? Yeah. What on earth? Okay. Let's wait now. A little croaker. Exactly. Go, oh, buddy. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> okay. Come on, fella. Slimy, slimy bugger. Okay. 
Now this ought to get me a big old redfish if there's one out there. on the bottom. Oh yeah, that might do it. Yeah, man. Mm. What have I got to do? Oh, hopefully it ain't another gar. Third gar of the day. It ain't fighting like much, kind of fighting like it might be a gar. I don't know. <sighs> oh, it's a dead gum turtle. Here you go. Here you go. Real whatever that is, and you catch yourself a fish. Ugh. Oh, Lord and mercy. I about had it with these. Nothing? I'll say. Look at that dude, boy. He ain't happy at all. Ugh. Yeah. I kind of hate to. Here it is. Look at him spinning. Twist my line like there ain't no tomorrow. Alrighty then, Bester. Okay. He won't just sit still, will he? Mm. <laughs> Get him in the mouth too. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're still falling. I'll get you. Yeah. Hmm. You wouldn't know help if it bit him in the ass. Uh -uh. Little bugger. Uh, all right. Oh, watch out! <laughs> Wee! Oh my goodness! I'm gonna buy a hook. Huh. You think with a catfish or a gar? Or a soft shot turtle? I think it's a little body. I'm pretty sure this is a fish this time. Oh, dude, come on. Oh, buddy. Is that, oh my goodness. Okay, here we go. Come on up in there. Whew. Okay. Gaff top cell catfish. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Need, huh? 